Yo, 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 what's good in the hood? Yeah, it's your boy, the man with the hood. Psych, it's Game Hub 2 with my crew. Anyway, guys, I'm going to stop playing with y'all. What's up, man? It's your boy, Game Hub 2. And I'm back with the part two to my airplane tutorial video. Also, town growth is included in this because, like, airplanes help towns grow shit like that <laughs> anyway anyway y'all get it but like i'm finna hop right into this tutorial so in the last video i talked about airplanes growing towns right now in this video i'm gonna talk about something else <laughs> that helps your town grow along with airplanes guess what they are B -b 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 buses that's right buses and um how exactly do buses help with town growth well they don't drive around carrying 95 passengers at a time number one number two they're pretty convenient so like everyone has access <laughs> to them thus helping the city grow somehow some weird thingy and number three they are pretty cheap to operate so like that's more in your bank account in the game because clearly you only have 12 million dollars and I'm not making shit but yeah I will show you guys how to make buses and how to make your towns grow <clears throat> so first here's here's a good thing that I want to point out I have one two three and four cities all right <laughs> next to each other now why the hell is that good? It's because I can grow four cities at once. Ooh, I can grow four cities at once. A. Hey. Mm. I don't know what rhymes with once. Mm. Anyway, fuck all that rapping. Let's just jump right into building so first you want to oh, open up your roads slot bar and then build yourself some roads god i had a massive stutter there but make sure they connect your towns or else this trick won't work or help you feel me so like let's say I start in get head cross get head cross that sounds like something from a horror movie maybe <laughs> anyways I'm getting off topic so what you want to do is place yourself a, a, a bus stop in the town center is cause th th that's where towns start ex expanding from and then place it in another town center and then place a road depot somewhere <laughs> tap on that road depot new vehicles and here you can buy yourself a bus it should be the first vehicle at the top but if not you can always keep scrolling down until you find the buses but but uh, I shall buy this Hereford Leopard Bus. Hereford. Has anyone ever heard of, of that company? Hereford. What type of company name is that? 
<laughs> Anyways, I shall buy it because it carries <laughs> the 35 passengers. Is max speed is 55 miles per hour, and it only costs eleven thousand four hundred eighty-four dollars. So I shall buy one. Give you some orders. Same thing as the airplane. Fully load any cargo and then uh, unload all cargo. Then we shall clone them so that there's more than one bus running. But don't do it if you don't have a lot of money because that can really set you in debt. And, um, yeah. So right now, I have 10 buses, I shall run them separately so that there's an even time frame in passenger loading phases. Damn it. I'm having fat stutters. I don't know why, but I am. But hey, I have a stuttering problem. So that's okay. And, and since this bus is almost halfway loaded, I will run another bus. There's another bus running. Damn, that's hard as a rock. Alright, that bus is 100% loaded. So now, I shall run a third bus. But in the meantime, let's follow this bus and see where it travels. Well, it's gonna travel to Gadhead Cross, so I don't know why I said that. And now it's unloading. Let's see how much we get paid off of this simple bus trip. $492. Not half bad, not half bad. But. But it could be more. But it's not. <laughs> and now it's finding its way back to our other city <laughs> now we shall run another bus <laughs> told him baby we don't got that long listen this is not my city so but I'll treat this like my city show. 25 minutes until I'm on. <clears throat> Alright. Let's see how much money a bus makes this time. $490. So, not, not half bad. And same thing for the other cities. Ooh, wish I'd do the exact same thing. What the hell? Why can't I move? Oh. I forgot. Okay. Not nah, move. Now, this town here is quite small. So I shall only run like four or five buses, maybe. 
Hell, I might even just run one. But this town here is quite large. So I will place a bus stop there. No! Let's bomb that bus depot. I don't want it there. I want it here. I'm now. Let's run five buses between here and Friendingville. Same thing, fully load any cargo, unload all, as always, because we want to maximize our profits and help town growth. And we shall get five buses on this route. We shall, we shall run those buses. Damn, that's all rock. I can't eat that. That's a rock. 12% was loaded, 23%. <clears throat> Hundred percent loaded. Now let's run our next bus. Uh, in the meantime, let's follow this bus to Friendingville. We are just casually waiting on this bus to travel to Friendingville. Okay, it has arrived to Friendingville. It is unloading, in which it will be done soon. And we have got paid six hundred and fifty-four dollars. Not half bad for a bus trip. Not bad. We shall run these next three buses or four buses. That matter. Bus here is leaving, so I shall send another bus out. Okay, and then I will send our last bus out to run this route. Okay, so now y'all might be wondering what does any of this have to do with airport growth? That is a fabulous question that I'm here to help you guys with. So, same thing as our city growth, but um, in, in, instead of running our buses to towns, we are just going to run them to the airport. So, let's just build a road from here to the airport. Rolling, rolling, rolling down the highway. And then, Let's place our bus stop here on the side of the runway maybe it's kind of an odd place to place a bus stop but for the sake of this game we can place them all alongside runways so then we're gonna run a bus route from from um gadhead cross central weird ass name for a city to Benpool Airport. Then, but but this time there's gonna be something different. So in crap, I can't even get my words out. So then on on.
Yeah, hey, Cross Central. We have full load any cargo, and then on Benpool Airport, instead of unload all, we're. transferring and then no loading so that it doesn't bring any passengers back and then we shall have five <laughs> buses running on this route and uh, let's make this bread Same thing here for Grinfing Hill City. So, um, we are just going to place another bus stop there. Grinfing Hill City Central. Make some buses run along that route. Between Grinfing Hill City Central. To Benpool Airport. Same thing, fully load. And then at the airport, we do transfer and don't bring anything back. So, no loading, transfer and leave empty. On the, and it shall be five buses on this route. Also, and then we shall run these buses. Yo. For your version, you can't. Which is some pretty messed up shit, but. Okay. okay, so our bus here is 74% loaded, so it is almost loaded and ready to go. In the meantime, let's check on these buses here, see how they're doing. So I'm assuming that's our first bus. And it... And it... Transfer 35 extra passengers to the airport. So that should help with town growth along with airport demand. But yeah, guys, that wraps up this video for today. Make sure to subscribe, comment. I seriously mean comment i want my comments flooded with comments but yeah comment subscribe like share anything else you feel me and yeah i will see you guys in a future open ttd tutorial video